KHQA's Sensational 7. We are breaking a little new ground this week in the countdown to prove there is in fact room in the Sensational 7 for an elegantly made bogey. And you won't see one better than Maddie Hamilton's five on hole number 10 at Edgewood Golf Club from Monday's Class A sectional, a little chipping magic to limit the damage. The Pittsfield Sockies even their record to three and three on the year with a 29 to nothing win over New Berlin Friday. The problem was that game was still a scoreless tie into the third quarter, but Lane Elliott to the rescue, changing all of that for the better with this flip the script breakout home run. In similar rising fashion, the Louisiana Bulldogs are in the midst of a three-game win streak and used a little defensive pickpocket work from Ryan Caps to put the finish to MMA on Friday. The much-touted defensive end with the ahem interception here as a grace note on the Dogs' 65 to nothing win. Awaiting the Bulldogs this Friday, however, is unbeaten Bowling Green, and Dylan Dalton has been displaying a little magic of his own this season. The Bobcat quarterback proves an escape artist of the highest order here with this now he's tackled, now he isn't moment in the big win over North Callaway. And similarly, Western Illinois defensive back Jalen Poe pulled a disappearing act of his own with this interception and tackle escape en route to a pick six to open the Leathernecks comeback attempt in an eventually heartbreaking loss to SIU. It's been a minute, but it wasn't so very long ago that Jirel Brock touchdowns were a staple of this enterprise. So why break with tradition just because Quincy High's finest is now playing on Saturdays? This seven yard swing pass from Brock Purdy gave Jirel his first collegiate touchdown and helped punctuate an epic blowout of Kansas, always an added bonus in this corner. And while we're on the subject of great collegiate touchdowns, Quincy University's Teon Harris and Eugene Witherspoon fashioned a dandy on Saturday as part of the Hawks' epic win over Missouri S&T. Just three plays into the game, Harris challenges triple coverage on Witherspoon and is rewarded by his receiver's unreal concentration and hands with a 37-yard touchdown. If you thought Quincy Notre Dame's soccer star Tanner Anderson was running out of ways to impress us by scoring goals, think again. In Monday's run over win over McComb, Anderson found a unique way to redirect an assist into the net, going full back heel here to beat the bomber keeper. Toss in a spectacular golden goal Thursday against Dunlap in a 1-0 win at the Great River Classic in Burlington, and I think you can fairly say it's been a banner Tanner week right here, sensational seven style.